everybody. So, um, it's been two weeks exactly um, since I first put these two strand twists in. And I'm probably going to take them out really, really soon, if not tonight, tomorrow. So before I do that, I want to go ahead and show you guys how I put in Shelby's on my two-strand twist. Now, a lot of people think that in order to be able to use Shelby's or carry shells, like this one, you have to have dreadlocks um, or locks. Uh, but that's not the case. You can use them on your two-strand twist or, you know, my little pen that I got here. Or even, like, making your own little accessories. Like, I made this myself. You guys have probably seen this a million times. This is my little choker that goes around my neck. Um, and it also doubles as a little headband. I got to situate it. But, yeah. Anyways. Um, yeah. You can do a lot of stuff with these shells, um, but for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to show you how I put it in my hair. So, what you're going to need, what you're going to need is a beater. And it looks like this. You can find this at any beauty supply store. They go from 50 cents to a dollar, so it's really cheap. And um, you're going to need some rubber bands. So, what I do is, I insert my beater through the opening, and I consider this to be the top and this to be the bottom. So, I insert my beater through through the top of the shell, and all you do is, I'm going to take this one, all you do is take your hair, slip it through, put the shell in, and you guys have seen me use this before for my um, beaded flat twist tutorial. So, all right, so now my shell is in my hair. And um, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take the shell, and instead of my hair being at the top of the shell, I'm gonna make it so that it's at the bottom of the shell. And my hair's gonna go around. And I'm just gonna, like that, so. My shell's at the end of my hair, and all you do to secure it is put a rubber band. Hopefully I'm catching this. Okay. That's it. And you just... Ow, oh, in my face. Of course I wouldn't put this right in my face, but, you know, my hair is up or whatever. So, you would distribute this all around your twist, wherever you want it. You can have as many or as little as you want in your twist. Um, you can even go as far as to uh, put some beads in and then have your shell at the bottom at the ends. I've done a style like that once um, where I did that. But that's pretty much it. That's how, you, that's how I put my shell beads in my hair on my two-strand twist. Hope that helps. Um... Yep, so that's pretty much the whole tutorial. So I'll see you guys later really, really soon. Um, I'll definitely definitely be doing a twist out video so you can see how my twist out uh, turns out, which should be really good because I'm looking at these twists and I can just imagine how great my twist out is going to be. Anyways, I'm running my mouth. So see you guys later. Bye.